Hello everybody, this is Video Junkie 91 here. We're going to play some The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus today. Uh, today we want to show off a character mod. We show we show we um looked at I guess would be the best past tense form of that word. We looked at May a few episodes ago and now I want to look at Saul because Saul is a character I really like and that doesn't necessarily mean I'm good at winning with him but I think he's fun just from a mechanic standpoint because you gotta, you gotta uh, move your character. I'm the character with the crown, that's King Saul and then uh, I think the patch notes say this guy is called like Jonathan or something which um, if you're going by like the biblical themes, which I guess it is, because that's uh, one of the most notable King Saul or King Saul. He was a character in the Old Testament who has a son named Jonathan. So maybe they're going for that. Oh, that was bad. But, um, and I like the fact that he's in a heavy chainmail. Um, I'm guessing that's kind of like how when David fought Goliath in the Bible, Saul said, you know, you'll be equipped with, I'll get you some armor, you're gonna do this, and David was like, ah, uh, I can't do this, I'm like a 17 year old kid, I can't actually move around in this armor, it's too heavy for me. So, maybe it's a reference to that, maybe not, but um, we're just gonna try and have some fun with this character. Uh, the dodging is going to get tricky, and especially when you put Sloth into the mix. But, I'm going to get him with our, with our uh, Tammy's head type shot. So you're probably noticing a few things when we pick up two of diamonds. Um, when he's inside me, he gets the tear, or when he shoots through me, he gets uh, the, my mover, little Jonathan, gets a um, tear buff. And you also notice, so I'm basically like a reverse dimensional baby. You'll also notice that, um, you can put out, uh, fires and poops, and, um, if you saw I got hit, you can see on the stat tracker and just by character, um, he'll get a tears up grade, and then you heard this little, like, uh, ding sound. When that goes off, that means you can run into him and get that. Tammy's burst type homing attack. Ah, oh, I forgot to move him. As you can see, we're not the best. We're probably gonna have to rely on the strength card to get through the boss fight. That's just nothing. And we have curses all lost. Um, we don't like this being lost. Especially because I've been thinking about where I'm going. Making the good old mental map. This looks familiar. Yeah, this looks familiar. Did we go in here though? All right, we got our item. Got our game big breaking bug right away. I'm gonna try not to use our strength card, but <laughs> oh, we almost got him. Get peed on. Nope, he's not gonna run, run into my pee. There you go. There's a. Yep, I get to show it off just as I died, and that was just, that was just in the first floor, that was a 3 minute and 48 second run. Um, so now you get to see where he really excels at, and it's this great coward stuff. The Binding of Isaac is a game where if you learn how to be a coward, you will succeed. It might take a while, like, it might actually take a long time. But if you get the, um, the Tanuki suit in the orbital, you can win anything. You can win anything if you're a coward enough. Like, I gotta run from this guy and let my friend do all the damage. And I still messed it up. But that's alright. Fight is after us. That was, that was a surprise, I gotta admit. Yeah. So he exploded into a burning leaper, which is kind of unfair. I don't think that guy's inside drawn fire. Let's go with more friends. Uh, I know some people don't like the Pokeball the most, but oh, I'm gonna. 
Uh, I missed, and then I accidentally killed him with the Tammy's head Jonathan burst. So, that is, that's embarrassing. But this is, he changes up the gameplay a lot. This is like the type of character that I like to see in mod, you know, not just, there are some that are, I would describe as low effort, like, uh, there's one Ezio one, and I feel bad kind of insulting it, but it just, there wasn't a lot. It was kind of just, you know, oh, your tears look like daggers, because that's a thing in the games. And not to say it's a bad one, but it's just, I didn't, I played it for like half a run, and it's like, that'll do, that'll do. So, I don't want to get any of that. Not seeing anyone I want to capture. Um, if we get a uh, flickering light bulb, that'd be really good. Cause um, well, it depends on how we want to use it. Cause you can't have multiple friends, so let's just make sure he's not killing everyone. All right, you don't need to weaken him anymore. His health is what? No. Okay. Did, did no one see that? I, I used my item and little Jonathan just teleported to me and immediately did his Tammy's head burst to kill the guy I was trying to capture. Kind of unfair. Alright, we gotta do some science. Look at that! Why is he... Why is he getting me? Okay, so, um, I think I found a way to break the game, as saw, so, just get an item and use it, and apparently Jonathan will teleport right into you. I mean, I literally don't have any other items, so I don't know what could be doing it. And I died. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's do another one and try and figure this all out. Curse of the Blind. Get the defensive position. Then we need to kind of start killing the spawners. We got them. And he instantly breaks poop, so it's a bit faster that way. Yeah, Curse of the Blind. Um, well. Ah, uh, this might do nothing, or this might break the character. We shall see. I'm the king of the dunces now, though. Um, okay, so it breaks the character in a good way, because he can just shoot twice as many tiers. I don't think he can really aim that second tier that's coming off, but it's... <laughs> you see... <laughs> He's probably gonna hit some enemies on accident, like a good amount, so I'm not that upset. Oh, I'm upset at this room. I've made a mistake, and I survived. No bombs. I see that tinder drop there. I like those pennies. Uh, nothing else we want to do. We're just going to fight the boss. Ooh, alright, yeah, yeah. Can we do- oh, both? Yeah, okay, but don't take down damage, though. Keep bursted. We did it. Okay, so Wiz is now a good item if you saw. And we get an HP upgrade, which we'll like. Alright, Curse Room. Uh, we have three Red Hearts, so we don't want to take Red Heart damage, but that's probably not going to happen. We're probably not going to avoid taking Red Heart damage, that is to say. It probably will happen. Two Keys, Blood of the Martyr, which is a good damage upgrade. We're at 4.45. And we get another hat. Okay, uh, you're actually blocking the way, title code. So that's 
nice and cool and all, but let me see though. Alright. Oh, that was a lot of damage. And we can occasionally get two guys at the same time. Emperor's card is good. It'll let us it'll let us up our damage for one room. Uh it's usually a good idea to plan on using it on the boss. Okay. Especially when you want to get the boss fight over with quickly because you don't have any spirit hearts or demon hearts protecting your red hearts. And you want to deal with the devil because it's the second floor and you got a 100% chance. Mom's Pearl, it emanates purity. There are some like holy related items that I, or trinkets I kind of get mixed up. This is one of them. I have like the vague recollection. Maybe it does something related to spirit hearts. Oh, we got one key and eight pennies. We gotta make a choice if we can dodge. Okay, because it might be good to get Sackhead. By might be, I mean it, it will be good. That's just like a no brainer. Can we get to 15 cents though? That's the question. Uh, we don't have any more. There's a penny. We don't have any more bombs. Okay, just dodge everything. Dodge like a good dodging person. Pretend to be something you aren't. Uh, we don't have any effects, so if we pick one up, let's do it. Uh, let's pop our input card right now. Fight the littlest horn. So speaking of more references to the Bible, uh, there, the term little horn d does, yikes, pop up in Daniel, so I'm not sure if the reference is that or not. Seems kind of unlikely. Tears, torn photo, tears, and shot speed up. I like it. Let's go get our deal with the devil. We have, let's just go with the way to produce more black hearts and that might stay open, I'm not sure, but if, if we can get one more thing, that'd be nice. Uh, we're not going to. Well. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna check the curse room, which might be a bad idea. It's... Ah! Uh. Uh, I messed it up, but I got some health out of it, so I think we're still alive technically, and we're not peeing on the floor, which is a good sign. And we ended up not being able to get a uh, sackhead, so let's just take this and get out of here. Uh, pretty good floor since we got a fame and some spirit hearts. I'm gonna bank on second hand. Because. You usually get an a single tier effect by the time you've completed a run. Oh, we're doing good on health. Okay, well. We still have. We didn't lose the old precedent. And we got two demon hearts out of it, so. Kind of. Good job. Okay, not good job there, though. Lots of batteries, no usable items. Uh, I don't like that, I just don't like it, and we don't ever have to go in there, so that's good. Oh, that's bad damage. Get him before he does anything silly. And a demon beggar we could blow up. Um. What? Okay. Slug guys are not fun. Get him with little Jonathan. Alright, try and give Jonathan some damage while avoiding all the shots. From the white diglets. Oh! I got greedy for the Tammy's head type first. Luck down. Not a good pill. Would not recommend it. Ah, 
I'm not sure that's gonna do anything because we don't fire tears anyway. No, no. Uh, I will take Holy Mantle. Yeah, uh, Lil John seems to be getting messed up by anything that changes the room up. All right. Okay, there's our holy mantle. Cause when I rerolled, he uh, teleported right to me, which would be an interesting thing. But I don't think that's a uh, don't think that's intentional. It's scary, and he got me, and. Uh, the same doesn't work with whole mantle. Sad. There goes whole mantle. But, um, props to the Wiz, it's still doing its job great. Uh, I'm still hitting multiple guys. Also, Jonathan doesn't get a buff if I lose holy mantle. Yeah, it's kind of inconsistent, I think, about which items, which on-hit items work with Holy Mantle and which ones don't. The Frail, um, came out of nowhere, I don't like that. Just so you know, it's not a big fan, not a big fan! Wow, um... Ah, uh, so, what happened there, I think, was that his, um, Jonathan's Tear burst got charged up, and uh, the frail jumped at me and pushed me into Jonathan. So we got a tears upgrade, and he fired a burst of tears. I don't want to take Dark Judas, that might mess up the whole run. That might uh, ruin the character, I mean. But we will take the mark for a damage upgrade. There, two, three. And it's very important to remember that if you're playing as the lost or you have one, no key, if you only have one or half a heart or one heart remaining, that uh, blood banks go right through. Holy mantle. We can't fly still. Uh, shoot them. I like having the whiz. That's the one thing I can't stop talking about. Uh, don't be so afraid. You have Holy Mantle. Get him! And I don't have to worry about uh, the Acid Creed guys, champions. Speed down. I'm not a huge fan. Please don't. Yeah, and you can't stop Jonathan from firing. So. On rooms like this, you kind of just gotta hope that you don't get dusted by the exploding bomb flies. Uh, mom's pad, because we literally don't have anything else. And it could help. There. Get all those guys. Get a key. Uh, exploding guys are kind of dangerous. Gotta watch out for them. Got them all. See, that's the other one. The Bible tract, Faith Up. It does something. Uh, Toxic Shock is good. It's a, um, Atribus Plus item. And what you saw there, that was Toxic Shock. That was all Toxic Shock. What it does is, uh, does, like, damage to all enemies in a room, like, for a few seconds. Now, if you have low enough health, you just walk in the room and win. It's really fun. We get our luck back to zero, we get amnesia, which is hilarious, and we didn't get blown up. These guys are not long for this world, we have 4 keys, 10 cents. Ah, another buddy would be nice. So, let's check for a secret room. Nothing. No, that's a moving box, so never mind. We'll just take out this mystery gift. Honestly, who put the steam sale in the shop in a, you know, <laughs> wrapped up in a gift box? Take care of them. Oh, also another secondary effect. Uh, when enemies die, they leave a pool of 
green creep. Which, like, it's another reason why it's the, one of the best items ever. Because enemies that spawn enemies when they die just don't know what to do. They just instantly die. Which is a good feeling. And Bonnie Vizek, it's always a good feeling when you can turn the tables on the monsters. Oh, uh, if we stay here, I think we're good. No, he's gonna shoot. But if we stay here, he can't ever spawn anything. Will that do anything? Oh, that made him. We can get our thing off. Ah! Okay, we took one hit. Ah, I don't really want a range upgrade. And I can get those fires, and you can get, um, bruh, excuse me, orange fires just right out of the way. Hello, Brimstone. Goodbye, Brim. Goodbye, Krampus. Yeah, we'll take head of Krampus. This will synergize great with bugs, where little Jonathan teleports right to you. Because we'll have uh, Krampus' head and Tammy's head almost, basically, at the same time. Thank you again to Toxic Shock, making all the enemies have a bad day. Making all the enemies have a bad day. Day. Get some work started on the spawning portals. Dodge these guys. Don't run into these guys. As you can see, they just died on their own. I only had to help them out a little bit. So these guys can actually get kind of annoying. Um, the item that lets you feel uncharged with these guys, uh, any form of piercing shot. Alright, uh, strength, we don't want to, we want to hold on to our joker card. And if we don't get deal for that on this floor, then we will pop it. And see what deals we can get. Yep, take care of them. Uh, another strength card. And then I'm going to rely on my invincibility to just tank through it. Amnesia. Ha. That's fun. Joker. Yeah, getting two cursed lofts in a row can really feel, make it feel like the run is dragging on. Even though it's been 14 minutes. Um. Okay. He's actually kind of fast. Faster than I am. Okay. Get ready. We got this. Okay. Okay. Me and Lil John got this. He just toasts his own children. Savage. Yeah, spawn some guys so I can make creep for you to walk into, please. Uh, but not rich. And by rich, I mean we have 20 cents, but... You always want to say you're rich when you get 10 cents in this game. Hold on. Ooh, I'm coming. I really like that. You guys get... Dunked on. Alright, cramps his head. Um, betrayal. So, I don't want to say it's bad, because even though it is, Wiz is bad too, so... And things could happen with it, with, uh... Like, I'm guessing this guy will be able to hit bad guys in the back a lot more. And we finally got to use our Krampus' head. Got hit there and see the... Krampo... Jonathan Tearverse combination attack. We take a little gish. We can get a deal, so we take a deal. We get two demon hearts and... Guppy's hairball, which I don't think that's going to be too much to use. Um, we're literally, like, too slow to use it properly. 
But I don't think anyone takes Guppy's hairball to use properly. If anyone takes Guppy's hairball because they want to use it as a weapon, please leave a comment on this video zone. Please talk to me. Please talk to, like, literally everybody else in the Binding of Isaac community. Uh, took damage. That's not good. That's not good either. Uh, I just double down the damage. Kind of smart boy. Yeah, little Gish, if you're happy about firing, just, you're not, you're not gonna be doing any of that. This is weird. Why did he get, um, charmed? Is it because of backstabber? Tricky dodges. Come on. And, yeah, you want to... When you hear the ding, you want to make sure you and Jonathan cross paths. Which sometimes you want to walk over to him, and sometimes you want to, like, meet in the middle. What's going on? I can't see. I just know I beat that room by being good, I guess. Let's get him. Oh, uh, that was cool. We have seven keys, so we're gonna open this. Whew, do we wanna reroll everything? 48 hour energy. Let's take a chance and reroll everything. Rusted key, we have, ah, uh, hold on, two spades. Sent accuracy brings power, I like that. We have this little personal defense system in, um, Gemini, got a lot of spirit hearts, uh, does that do what I think it does? Yep, we got number two, we got some damage upgrades, uh, and by some damage upgrades, I mean it's kind of ridiculous. But anyone like to get destroyed? <laughs> that is like... An explosion and sad bombs which means I can create that tier burst whenever I want and I do believe that uh, if we have the um, I do believe that it will be uh, the damage will be based on your accuracy stat from Deadeye looks like it I'm happy Although I'm not happy because these guys will actually follow your bombs and not get the tear burst. That would be a good mod. Um, swallowed bombs. Uh, swallowed sad bombs just explode from within the enemy. That'd be really cool. Get our secret room. Just get out of here. Uh, mom's wig. Wait, 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 wait. Is this gonna work? Yeah, it works. So we have infinite sad bombs. Two of spades we don't care about. It's just. Yeah, blown up. Run! Okay, so infinite poison bombs. Okay, that's kind of ridiculous. I guess I should try to use uh, store credit or the coupon. But that is quite all right. Where is the boss? He's the other direction. Just get destroyed by my little John. We can skip this room, pick up your pennies. You guys get annihilated. Okay, I'm actually losing. And yeah, we you old holy mantle. Don't forget about it. And toxic shock. Uh, we lost some good items. We lost some of the best items. Uh, we will do our best to live up to the 
to what those items were worth. That was weird. Okay, we got it. But we're basically winning! Okay. Yeah, this is kind of very powerful. Just a little bit. And we literally just missed Boss Rush. Let's take the Polaroid. Go up to Scarred Womb 1, Curse the Unknown. I actually don't know what we had. Everyone just getting annihilated. Alright. Okay, hi. Big explosion of tears. Thank you, guys. This is a bigly shaped floor. Um, so we have like a tier delay of 8, I'm being told by the stat screen. I'm just gonna send out a some sad bombs because they kind of destroy everything and we're going to dodge shots. Alright, we did it. We don't want to go through this trap door or through the spike room door because we don't know how much health we have. Oh, you don't even fire. You're an idiot. <laughs> you didn't bring someone else? Yeah, I brought someone else. I can't even shoot, so I don't know what you're expecting to do. I look like the Incredible Hulk's mom right now. I wonder what she would be doing with her life. So you're a scientist! I was hoping you could be a superhero, son. But mom, just, ah. You know, like that Captain America. He's doing good for himself. He doesn't ever swear. I don't ever swear either, mom. Well, that's because you turn into a giant green rage monster whenever you say the word poo. Uh, hot bombs. Uh, we like all these bomb synergies. We don't like all these non-my-bomb bombs. We don't like luck down. Hey, there's something that, uh, re-rolling literally everything doesn't literally re-roll. Doesn't change up your pill rotation. Ha! This game is wrong. Um, it's now consumer deceit. You've been lying to us, Edmund. Uh, I want my money back, and then I'm going to use it to buy the game as soon as you, you change the re-rolling rules. Because I actually really like this game. Hello, secret boss I didn't know about. And I wouldn't want to cause undue defamation. Uh, that's undue defamation. Do I think Edmund is doing something wrong? No. But that doesn't necessarily mean I'm totally pleased with, uh, the state of some of the bugs. Uh, I play the PS4 version a lot with my wife, and... We kinda think the crashing happens when you're doing too good. Like, oh, she has 60 cents and he walked into the shop. Would be a shame if the game crashed, wouldn't it? And that's not even mentioning the 3DS version. Take care of all of those guys. More bosses. I've lost you, Mr. Boss. I like how this guy is a lot more accurate than I can be. Uh, hurry up and take him out. Take these guys out. My little Gemini friend is doing business. Just barely dodge. And if you keep in count, this is the third curse of the lost on this run. Oh, that, that was number two. I wasn't looking out. And we have 0.68 speed. If you wanted to count that too. Just counting can be fun, especially when you have 0.68 speed. 
and you're wandering through one of the larger endgame floors with Curse of the Lost. Hello, Wrath. Get taken care of. I'm too lazy to go get those bombs because that would take another 20 seconds at this speed. Now, okay. Well, at least we haven't been in this room before, so that's good to know. Just gonna sit him here, go hide out in the corner. Alright. He is a good buddy, slash character. I don't know if you'd call him a buddy or a character since he's an integral part of the character. Hello, guys. Can we pop up, please? There we go. One shot everyone. Doing great on health. And my least favorite champion might just be the white shaded ones that spawn the flies. Especially the um found the jumping fatty who like turns into a torso and then just mm, bad leg bad bleh, bad damage turns into a pair of legs. Not a pair of bad legs, although they're not too pleasant. But yeah, I I realized that that champion version of those guys will literally spawn flies every single at every single stage of their dying, even though they're not dead. Um, literally, what what is um? I'm kind of getting lost in the detritus of tear death. I'm spitting out. Thread the needle on these shots. Ah, uh, let's not do anything special. Let's not get complicated about it. Might be running kind of... I gotta see. I gotta do the science. Yeah? That's nice. Uh, I think I put it down before the scattered bombs counted. Hot point. Yeah, this is getting out of hand. This is getting out of hand, and I like it. I like it being out of hand. Alright. Now, I will be curious what happens if we get Dr. Fetus or Epic Fetus. Dodge. Oh, hey, you're not my friend. You're my enemy. Yes, yes, I know. Only a Seth deals in absolutes. Okay. If we had a really good knockback, we could have just kept him. Stuck in the corner. So does soy milk? Uh, does soy milk work well with uh, actually being power or not? I'm not sure. We took care of him. We got 21 keys, which is probably more than we'll need. This is a mess. Get out of here. Um. Isn't that supposed to be a library with like books and stuff? PhD! Better pills and full health apparently. Speed up! Thank you! Sticky bombs. Bogo bombs. Blister shot. This might be better than being able to use a bomb like what? One of the two rooms? Uh, doesn't control those, but that's alright. We got a year rune, and we're getting ready to head down to the chest. This is good, good. Well. We'll have to see. Oh! Taking dumb damage. Uh, so remember that bug? Yeah, I can do this now. Uh, do we have... Can- ow. Can be in conception from something? Because we now have... An incubus? I think that's ours. Well, I'm not gonna get... Damage up here. 
Uh, I don't know. I might be going crazy. Uh, if you think I'm going crazy, please, um, like, comment, and subscribe like any doctor should. More bomb stuff. We already have toxic bombs. I mean, Guppy. So, like, thanks for the five bombs, I guess. Oh no, I forgot to use the air rune. Uh, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I'm not the smartest player. Let's throw this up. Did we get anything? No, not really. Not really anything worthwhile. Uh, I walked right into that. Death laser. Get all these guys. Hello, bombs. He is really spitting out the tears, especially when I get hit. Just him left, I think. And drop the bomb. And if you're still keeping the score, we are actually still too slow to do anything. But our little guy. Uh, his speed has been affected, and he's spitting out deadly tears of multicolored death. Yeah, I can't eat it now when I control the explosion. It's definitely taken care of. This guy can get taken care of. Hello? Something is somewhere. There we go. We got it. There's a another line around the corner. And we ran into a dead end and we have 0.83 speed. I would like for this to change. Waiting on our speed to change. Ah, I don't think I'm gonna get a chest. I don't think a chest is gonna drop. We only have one lock. Let's we'll see. All right. Take care of him. Take care of him. Take care of them. Um, be careful about doing that. Just I can't see. The devil. I like that. I like the devil. Not literally though. Okay. I kind of like how I literally don't prefer Book of Sin, Book of Evil to the Bible. And if I said I prefer Book of Revelations to the Bible, that wouldn't make no sense. Cause unless there's actually a book called Book of Revelations. Because it's certainly not the last book in the Bible, which is Revelation. But, hey, Revelation is like a really popular subtitle for whatever boring sequel is coming out. And if you think I'm joking, like, find me a work of fiction that has the word Revelation in it, that or Revelations, that isn't a sequel. I'll wait. This guy just spawned, so there's nothing he can do. All he can do is send out his children to die a quick death. This guy's gonna get me. Let's take like him. Wait, come on. So my butt bombs have everything. I wasn't sure if they'd have all the all the work. Yeah, yeah. You can't do nothing. All right, we're at the blue baby fight. We basically slammed on him, full force. Uh, he doesn't know what's hitting him. Come and get me. Oh, he actually didn't get me. I'm dumb. But that's all for today. Uh, if you like what you see, subscribe for more content, 
leave a comment about stuff you like seeing. Like this video, share it with friends, and tell me what else you want to see, because I really like doing uh, modded care. I really like King Saul, and I really... There's some pretty interesting mods I like to look at, but that's it for now. Goodbye.